Bulls fans, Adam here. here. I'm back at FFG, and I'm going to get to play X-Wing 2.0. I have Frank here. He's going to show me the ropes. We're going to go through the lists, and uh, I'm going to get to fly ships. Let's do it. All right, Frank, uh, one of the lead designers here uh, at FFG, is going to show me the ropes for X-Wing 2.0. Frank, show me your list, man. What are you rocking today? Sure. So today I'm going to be flying uh, Darth Vader with four Black Squadron pilots, each equipped Ooh. with classic crack shot. <laughs> um, it works a little differently this time around, Crackshot specifically, as you the defender needs to be inside your bullseye arc. So, as we were talking before, uh, having to require uh, the opponent to be in a specific position in order to most benefit from your cards, we're trying to play that up a lot more. Cool. Um, so and yeah. By the way, these are the new cards. Are these going to be the ones in the box? Are they yeah. just uh, prototypes? Or? Uh, these are uh, some of the components themselves are. Um, are fake, but uh, every, <laughs> otherwise it is, yeah, yeah. as you see, is, is how it, it is going to look in the... Yeah, so we've got brand new cards, uh, new upgrades, there's a million and one little changes, right? Oh, um, yeah. We'll probably go over these, but yeah. let's... Uh, if you see a card, it, it, it'll probably be similar. I mean, these two named names are familiar, very different effects. Mm -hmm. um, this effect, sim uh, effect you might recognize, but obviously different name, and it being a force power. Oh, and that's the new force token. Yep. Was it the force uh, yep. force charges, charges. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And then these are the new charge charges. <laughs> yes, the standard charges that yeah. you use for other effects. So Just to show off, there's an active yeah. and an inactive, right? There's an inactive. Yep. Exactly. Very cool. So yeah, yeah we can track uh, limited use effects. So you can use afterburners twice in the game. Um, cluster missiles. Uh, you have to spend to do the attack, and you can spend again to attack again, in a similar uh, capacity to first yeah. edition. Um, so yeah, there's our new cards. So we've got sense. Vader, uh, he's got Sense, Afterburners, Fire Control System, uh, Cluster Missiles, we've got a Black Squadron Ace with Crack Shot, and then a whole bunch more of <laughs> that same thing. <laughs> of that same thing, mm -hmm. so. And then, uh, can we talk about the ships real fast? Because these, yeah, sure. these are new and improved and... Uh, yeah, I mean... The bases, at least? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, these are, uh, the Tybanced is the same as mm -hmm. it has been, obviously, uh, Painted uh, very well. <laughs> yeah. Um, yep. And the tie van tie fighters as well are yeah. very similar. Uh, we didn't mention this the other day, but the new um, one of the other changes is the way we're handling target locks this time. Okay. So instead of you getting a blue and red target lock specifically, we actually have uh, target locks that are attached to associated with the number from your ID token. So okay. you can see here is the target lock for the tie advanced. Mm -hmm. um, if you, you use the white side instead, we actually have the white side. So oh. um, one person will play with black numbers, the other person plays with white numbers, and then we can uh, go from there. Track your locks like that. Cool. So yeah. Oh, and here's the new dials as Ooh. well. So here you're able to uh, adjust it this way. So that's how you identify your. Uh, okay, so number. the top one is going to be where that is, mm -hmm. and then the bottom one is where you where spin. you can grab it. Okay. So in fact, you can do it one handed now. Hey. I guess that was a really bad example of it, but yeah, <laughs> you could rotate it one handed. Um, well, yeah, the name of the ship on the back. So. Very cool. Yeah. All right, so that's uh, that's the Imperialist. Yes. Oh man, the Tie Swarm is back with a vengeance, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's go take a look at my uh, my Rebels, huh? All right. Okay, so here's my Rebel list, real fast. I've got Dutch. I've got uh, Wedge, and I've got Luke. Classic, uh, kind of like, you know, Imperial Trench Run style. Yeah. But um, real quick, there's some changes, obviously. we got some new stuff going on. Mm -hmm. Can we? Can you walk us through our list here? Sure. Yeah, so here, uh, Dutch has a, an ability that's very reminiscent of his first edition ability. It's a little more friendly, being range 1 to 3. Um, and also, you'll notice the change of language where it says on an object instead of on a mm. ship. So in uh, second edition here, you'll be able to walk on obstacles as well as other friendly ships or enemy ships. Object in general is just the general term. Um, there'll be other effects that you can spend locks from friendly ships, etc. So uh, that's another uh, adjustment to the language to be able to account for that sort cool. of thing. Um, seismic charges work a little bit differently than they did in first edition. Instead of them just doing one damage to everything around them, you actually choose an obstacle at range one and that obstacle detonates as well dealing damage to everyone around them, Very and then cool. you remove the obstacle. Kind of like how it looked in um, Attack of the Clones. Yeah, yeah. Uh, which, where they're from originally from. Um, this also mentions this system phase, mm -hmm. which is uh, the phase that happens between the activation, and, or the planning and the activation phase, where various effects, such as dropping bombs, can occur. Yeah. And we'll talk about the phases of the game, you know, mm -hmm. kind of go over those mm -hmm. two, but. Yeah, and then the two charges as well. Yeah. Uh, we've got a turret 
Here you can see the little turret symbol to say that's the arc in which the attack uh, is performed from. If you look at the base now, it's and back. It as well. So you can have it shoot on the side, or the back, or what have you. Very cool. Mm -hmm. um, it also ha gives you the rotate action. So it, you didn't necessarily have rotate on your action bar already, but now mm -hmm. you do because you need to be you able have to the rotate your arc. Yeah. Yeah. Um, we have selflessness, which is, uh, again, similar to its uh, first edition counterpart. Um, playing up the rebel theme of yeah, yeah. helping out your friends, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, then we can move on to Wedge. Good old Wedge. And we have the wedge. new... What, this is a different layout, too. This, this S-foil is on yeah. the, the left of the so ship. So this is a con configuration, yep. as that symbol indicates. And those will be presented on the left of the list instead of on the right. Um, yeah, with, with the S-foils. And again, the X-wings wings actually do open and close. Mm. And just a pro tip, you, you pinch the engines, right? Yes, pinch the engines, not the guns, because you might accidentally break those guys. So, yep. So anyway, uh, yeah, when you, uh, at the start of your, when you activate, as it says here, mm -hmm. you can flip the card, boop, boop, go to the open side. Open side, it doesn't really do much, but... Real quick, too, yeah. it's a little... So open side doesn't do much. That's the standard positioning. Yeah. If, this is as, as though you didn't equip the card, basically. And then when you do flip it over, you uh, you, you perform a primary attack, roll one fewer attack dice, mm -hmm. So, but you gain boost. So yes. You know, and then... Also, linked boost. Linked from, boost. From this focus. is one of the new linked actions. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't appear on the X-Wing natively, but once you've equipped the s file, so you can get that. So similarly, you can flip back to the other side when your ship activates. Yep. And go right back to it. Yeah, for a long time we were always asking LFL um, whether the X-Wings can attack with their wings closed or not, and they didn't really want to give us an answer. Um, <laughs> but eventually it showed up in a Poe comic. So uh, it happened. And we were like, okay, well, there you go. <laughs> and then we've got Alt Maneuver, which has changed up just a little bit. A little it's bit. got a, a new symbol, which is yeah. the, the arc, right? Yeah, that's the front arc. So yeah. while you perform a front arc attack, mm -hmm. so that would include torpedoes or anything like that, um, you're able to uh, use Alt Maneuver. Yeah. So Elmaneuver's ability and Wedge's ability do stack in a horrible, Ooh. horrible way. Yeah, I'm starting to think about that already. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that one. And then oh, yeah. the new R4 Astromech, too. Yeah. So uh, similar to its uh, first edition counterpart, as far as reducing the difficulty of maneuvers. But yeah, we, we use the terminology reduce the difficulty instead of making it a very specific color. Yeah. So that you can turn your red maneuvers into white and your white into blue. Yeah, so. because blue is the new green. Blue is the new green. <laughs> <laughs> For the color friendly, uh, colorblind folks out there. Yeah. Uh, and then, of course, the base, too. Just to point these out, again, we've got the bullseye arc. Mm -hmm. uh, that's not uh, intrinsically, it doesn't do anything, yep. but it is there now because there are things that can trigger off that. Yep. Like the crack shot in uh, my TIE Fighters. And then off the back arc, we also have it on the actual base now, too, which mm -hmm. is pretty cool. Yep. So, in case we need to say uh, if an enemy ship is in your rear arc, you can actually measure that. Mm -hmm. Next up, we got a classic Red 5 here. Oh, yes. So, say hello to Luke, the new and improved. <laughs> <laughs> so, Luke real fast. He's got the yes foil options. Mm -hmm. uh, tell me about Luke. What changes uh, did, did Luke get? So, he has access to the Force now in a, yeah. in a, in a truest sense. Uh, he has the Force charges, uh, the purple number on the, the right of his stats there. Yep. Um, you can see the purple charges Down there. above the card there Yep. as well. Um, yeah, his ability uh, is pretty good, obviously. You, you'll, it'll probably trigger many times during this game. <laughs> um, it's pretty potent. Yeah. Um, we have Instinctive Aim on him, which is more or less Deadeye from first edition. Yep. But it is, plays up the idea of... The force power, and it does take a force charge to use. Does. So. Yeah, another cool. use of force charges. Yep. Uh, we've got R2-D2. Um, in this, he is, uh, again, reminiscent of his first edition ability, but this time... It is limited. You can only do it three times. So yeah. you're not going to be recovering 8, 10, 12 health <laughs> over the course of a game. You Darn. Only get three back. Yeah. Um, also, we played up the use of the disarm token. Mm -hmm. So instead of having to... Uh, uh, that, it's a new way that you can take a debuff to get a benefit. Yeah. So um, when you're, after you're in maneuver, you can say, like, oh, you know what? I don't think I'm going to get any attacks this round. I'm going to choose to use R2. Yeah, back, get a shield back. Recover yep. a shield, exactly. Cool. And then uh, Proton Torpedo's got, uh, got a tweak here too, right? Yeah, so now um, it also, had much like the turret earlier, has mm -hmm. the front arc symbol to show you it's a front arc attack. 
four dice. Mm -hmm. There's the little missile icon there yep. next to it, next to the two to th range two to three, yep. indicating that you do not apply range bonuses. Okay, that's um, what that means now, yeah. Yes, so as you saw on the turret, it didn't have that symbol because you would apply the range bonus. You would get to roll four dice at range one. Yeah. Um, we'll, with, we'll get into the ion effects yeah, with the iron, yeah. during, the, during the game, I'm sure. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, it has uh, two charges on there, so you can shoot your torpedoes twice. Which is nice. Yeah. Yeah. Twice as nice. Twice as nice. Uh, and the other thing, too, uh, it's, again, uh, attack uh, parentheses target lock. Yeah, so that is, it requires you to have a lock on your on the enemy, yep. but you don't have to spend it unless it's said to, which it doesn't, cool. so you don't. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. And then, of course, we've got the new, the new dials as well. Uh, yes. Um, again, the new style, and then I like the, the lower, you can rotate there, and then the, the top is where it's going to tell you what your actual action is. And you can see, again... Blue is the new green. Blue is the new green. So, very cool. Yeah, and if you actually look at the X-Wing dial, it's a nicer dial. Yeah. It's got, a, you got the two green, or two blue banks now, and yeah. you get the talent rolls much like the T-70. Sweet. So, I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, that would be <laughs> very fun to fly. Uh, and then real fast, too, there's also the change to the uh, the damage deck, right? Yep. These are the new damage deck cards, and hopefully we'll see some of these in action, but uh, <laughs> any, any surprises in there? Uh... Well, I don't want to spoil all the surprises, but there are some new uh, tokens being distributed via the deck, such as ion tokens. Sweet. So, yeah. And then, uh, last but not least, real fast, we, we talked about these already, but we wanted to show them off, of course. These are the new maneuver dials. Um, same, same. Uh, you can still use the old ones. Mm -hmm. They're the same shape. Uh, you definitely kind of want to get a new set now, because oh, yeah. the center line is for bumping, so mm -hmm. you can actually keep track. Uh, the one bank man, or the one straight maneuver has the things that you're going to need the excuse me for for barrel rolling. Yep. So for medium and large ships. Uh, real fast, can you show us how a barrel? Sure. Roll? Maybe not the Y wing. But <laughs> <laughs> well, the Y wing can barrel. Now. It can, yeah. Um, so it does to, it does actually have it? It's a it's a red maneuver. Yes. <laughs> so to barrel roll, you choose again like first edition. You say whether it's left or right. So in this case, let's say we're going to barrel to the left. You place the. Uh, marker along uh, the template along the side there, lining up this hash mark with the middle of the template there. Yep. Then you pick up the ship and you can place it in one of three positions. This one where you're lining that line with the back of it, yep. with the middle, or the front. Cool. Which also actually aligns the back of it. But anyway. So, yeah. so there's only three spots per side, giving you six spots you can end up with a barrel maneuver. Exactly. Uh, which just helps streamline it and doesn't give somebody that infinite infinite quote position <laughs> yeah so uh and yeah bring it, it more in line with boost which also has only three final positions right. and then this is a cool new uh cool new uh, addition what is uh what is that so this has to do with uh helping you if you need to displace a ship so for example let's say dutch is going to move first in this position and he's going to do sure. a three straight oh no that's so clumsy for me actually this makes it even more clumsy <laughs> yeah hard for me to do so I can use this marker to mark the position of wedge. Mm -hmm. Then I can perform the straight with the template here. Doo -doo -doo. And then wedge goes right back in. Ta -da. None the different. And that's actually. just going to come with the new yep. template set. So one for more sure. reason to get the course set. <laughs> cool. Well, you'll need it for the damage that can be. Oh, yeah. But. Yeah. <laughs> and the, the cool new ships. And by the way, I don't know if, if folks are noticing, mm. that Y-Wing looks a little beefier. Is yeah. That, it's got like a turret up top, too. What's going oh, yeah. on with it's that? Oh, yeah. It actually physically sticks off the ship. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we, uh, we made it much more in line with the, uh, the original shape of the Y-Wing. Very cool. And and uh, I don't know if, if folks have caught this yet either, but uh, the paint jobs are a little different too. Yeah, it's a little subtle, but you know, X-Wings aren't uh, too terribly different. You can notice the different paneling here yeah. um, between them, the little blue. Uh, you also have the five um, stripes for red five. There you go. So that is Luke's specifically, um, while the other one r remains a little more generic. Yeah. Very cool. Well, yeah. let's uh, let's start playing. Let's do it. All right, Frank. So we're about to get started. Uh, we've got the the, the play man out. We've got everything uh, ready to go. Uh, setup wise, has anything really changed, or how is how does this part work? Sure, uh, it works very much like it did in first edition. So one of us will be the first player instead of having initiative. And as... We have our fancy new first player token. Indeed. Very cool. Yes, I I really like this design. I want a T-shirt that's just that simple. That'd be pretty <laughs> sweet. Front and back, or just. Uh, yeah, maybe it could. It could flip yeah, the yeah. other sides of the inverted <laughs> one. I like that. 
Or um, Inside Out really throw people. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how many people are going to get to see I that. But <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. So uh, as we're referring to it, the what was previously known as Pilot Skill as Initiative. Yeah. Um, initiative is become first player. So one of us will be the first player. The other player is the second player. Makes sense. Um, but the first player will place the first obstacle. Uh, the same placement rules as before. Beyond range one to two of an edge. Beyond range one of other obstacles. Yep. And we are using uh, some fancy store championship. Yeah, uh, 2016. 2014, so I wasn't actually the store champ. But. I wasn't either. Okay. I mean, I could have. But I uh, beat up the store champ and took it. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know which one of us actually has fewer points. I did not build either of these lists. <laughs> but um, we can say that you can be first player. Okay. If you'd like. Sure. And same range restrictions... Mm -hmm. So range one, range one. Uh, beyond, beyond two. Beyond two. Beyond one. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm going to go the for guy. the asteroid. Sure. And I'm going to chuck this one. I like throwing stuff right in the middle. Yeah. I'm more of a ninja star. Oh, you know, I just tossed them out there. Yeah, I feel, I'm always reminded of Go. I don't yeah. I've played Go at all, but I just feel like, you know, it's, it's one of those, oh, I see what you did there. Mm hmm. Mm. Okay, cool. So setup's pretty much the same. Yep. Um, so much like uh, first edition, we'll be placing our ships based on pilot skill. Yeah. Um, so I have a bunch of threes and a six. You have a four, five, and a six. Yes. So I'll be yes. placing my three, three or four threes first. Is that three times fast? Place your twelves. Got it. <laughs> Place your twelve ships. All right. So this will be at range one of the board edge here. Yep. Let's see. I do feel rather confident flying through these uh, obstacles. I might regret saying that later, but um, <laughs> I don't. <laughs> yeah, let's do it like this. Maybe a little rusty, but uh, we'll see. Mm -hmm. Crashes are part of the fun. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's what the movies taught me. Mm -hmm. I know there's uh, many uh, much discussion about the pinwheel versus the oh yeah classic grid. I'm still an old school guy. I do the classic. Classic grid. I like how the turns work together. Mm. But anyway. Yeah. Dutch. Let's see, I don't have a strategy going into this, folks. I'm just going to be uh, <laughs> trying to shoot some stuff. So we'll see how this goes. So when you place Dutch, you can choose the orientation of that turret. I was going to ask. Yeah. Yep. So you can start behind you, sideways, whatever. Start facing forwards then? Yep. Okay. Going straight ahead. All right. All head full. All right. All right. And then fives. Uh, that's your five. That's my five, which is going to be Luke, because of course he's a five. Of course. Red five. Red. You, you see what we're doing? Okay. <laughs> well, I know Wedge will be trying to flank me. What? Yes. Why would I do that? Outmaneuvering jerk. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah. I mean, these guys are fast. Yeah. So, got some options here. Yeah, let's just go over here. Oh, man. Yeah. Just give me the, the Vader, the Vader bait over there. Just. So I take Luke and Vader, or Luke and Wedge versus Vader, or do I try to <laughs> thin the herd over there? Mm. Uh. Oh yes, you also get to choose uh, whether your wings are open or closed as well when you place them. Um, the foils. And you can close them at when you activate. So you, activate. you could choose immediately as soon as you reveal your first dial to open or close them. But I, I start. I'm gonna position. start. Go closed. closed. Yeah. I want to go fast. I'm Ricky Bobby. <laughs> I want to go fast. All right. Here we go. All right. To dials. Dial time. So, um, have the uh, ha has the turn changed at all? Are there new steps, new uh, there things is, you need to be aware of? There's a two two things of note. First one being there's a new phase called well, the system phase, which occurs between the activation and the planning phase. I guess the other way between the planning and the activation phase. Um, it is also resolved in uh, initiative order, uh, much like the activation phase, going from lowest to highest. 
um, resolving those abilities. So my sense and your dropping a bomb from Dutch are both things that can occur during the system phase. You'd have to decide whether you're going to drop your seismic charge before I would get to resolve my sense effect if I would like. Um, the, other, the other one to note is that the combat phase is now called the engagement phase. The reason for this, of course, being that you activate during the activation phase and you engage during the engagement phase. You don't combat during the combat phase. Sure. Cool. A little awkward in English, so yeah. we chose to just change clean, that. Just clean it up. Right. Yeah. I feel like I have a lot more choices with the X-Wing dial now. So. Right? I guess we're gonna find out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so go to the system phase. I'm not gonna resolve sense. You're not gonna drop bombs. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna bomb mm -hmm. my side of the board. Sense. Yep. Mm -hmm. See what you do there. Mm -hmm. All right, so I will begin with my threes. Sure. So this black squadron ace. Uh, real quick too. Oh, yeah. uh, because they're all the same initiative, hasn't changed. You can resolve them in any order. Correct. So, Correct. Well, yeah. So tough. this time, I'm gonna start with this guy. All right. Boop -a -doop -a -doop. And so I can do the same classic actions that I used to be able to do. So I will just focus, not that. I don't think we'll be engagement range, but <laughs> perhaps. <laughs> this guy does a three turn. Okay, I think I'm actually going to do a barrel roll. So Ooh, yeah, if, I uh, see this in action. Yeah, so if you barrel roll and you end up overlapping an obstacle, mm -hmm. you just fail that action. So instead of you getting to, like if all three positions were to overlap it, I would just not be able to do it. So if I said, I'm gonna barrel the right and all three positions are overlapping, the action fails. So you don't actually get to go back and focus instead. Okay. So the game's a little more harsh in that regard. Okay. So um, you're, you're calling the action, and like normally you'd get to check, and be like, oh, or yeah, first exactly. position, you'd get to oh, I can't do that, so I'm just gonna do another action now. Yep. But now it's literally like, nope. Yep. Oh, that's, look at that. It's perfect. I'm just straight. Oh, oh it's great. Oh. <laughs> I think you've played this before. So pleased with myself. <laughs> All right, three turn here. Gotta have sound. I forgot my Star uh, Wars soundtrack, man. I just have that. What was I thinking? <laughs> All right, now I go with. Uh, my Y wing. Mm -hmm. So I'm doing a three bank. So I'm thinking long term here. I mean, yeah. I'm gonna move my turret to get Ooh. that side shot. I like it. Because you're heading that way. Uh huh. Um, can you still check for target locks? Ah, so the way target lock work now, which is just referred to as lock. Lock. When you lock. Um, you declare you're going to lock, then you can measure range to any number of objects. Okay. Then you can choose one of those to get a lock on. Similar to the barrel roll, if there was nothing to actually lock or you don't want to lock onto one of these obstacles mm -hmm. or a friendly ship or whatever, you just can choose not to lock anything, at which point you don't get a lock and you can't choose a different action. Either. Okay, so you can't... Okay, so it's it's uh, is it is a little bit harsher. It's a little harsher, but I like that. I so. think so too. I think people have gotten good enough at this point where they can be like, ah, yes, that looks that looks the right range, and okay. then they can just. I think I'm gonna stick with my original assessment, which was to uh, rotate. Rotate. So mm. I'm gonna move that turret to the uh, to the what is it? Uh, the starboard. starboard. Yeah. Yeah. So I remember that because it's port is four letters. Yeah, so that's laughing. how I remember it. Yeah. yeah. I watched a lot of Pirates of Dark Water as a kid, uh -huh. so I got my nautical. Nautical knowledge. Uh, <laughs> Luke's up. Uh -huh. All right, Luke, we are going three ahead. But I can boost. Yes. Which was kind of... Or barrel roll, because it's just right yeah, there on the, dial. There on the dial. On the dial. On the, on the, on the, yeah, action bar. All right, here we go. I think I'm go Yeah, let's boost, because first off, that's cool. Mm-hmm. Um, so like to boost to the left, straight, to the right. I think I'll get more distance if I go left. Or, not more distance, but... 
I may get a shot. I don't know. I'm kind of. I just want to roll some. Uh, I just want to shoot <laughs> some stuff. To be perfectly honest, so mm -hmm. I'm gonna go into that. All into right, that. we're doing it. By the way, force yeah. force tokens. Yeah. Uh, do they do anything intrinsically? Like. Yeah. So when you're attacking or defending, yeah. you can spend them to uh, change one or more results. Or one uh, one result to a success result. So if let's say you rolled this for attacking, you could spend one force point, one force charge to change one to a hit. Similarly, here you could change it to invade. Okay. If you had two, for example, you could spend two to change two. Okay, so you can spend multiple ones. Yep. Spend up to that many up to, to change that many. as many. Okay. And then um, wedge. Wedge is doing a similar. I'm a little uh, thrown off by the upside, like the, again, the, the dials. Oh right? yes, yeah. A little, little different, but it's still mm -hmm. it's easy to read, and it's uh, I like that. So it's a three ahead. Mm -hmm. Would you like to boost with him? I don't think I do actually. I'm worried about Vader getting a shot on me <laughs> <laughs> round one. Uh, I, don't, I mean, if I'd gone four and boosted, yeah. Mm. So. Mm. You can just focus. I think I'm just going to focus. Focus. No target locks. Yeah, no barrel. Eh, that's, that's, that's fine. <laughs> that's okay. Mm -hmm. we'll, we'll do that. All right. Okay. I like the focus. And then focus has, has using focus. Oh, go ahead and do oh, your move sure. first. And then we'll... So I'm doing a maneuver that was impossible in first edition. What? A one straight on a tie advanced. That's crazy. I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> I've never seen such maneuvering. <laughs> yes. Quite slow. That's one of the, and also you can uh, do talent rolls now too. Yeah. So. By the way, yeah, the X, the, the T65s, mm -hmm. talent roll. You have talent roll. Yes. So what is Vader's dirty tricks? Uh, uh, his dirty tricks are, uh, after you perform an action, you can spend a force charge to perform an action. So it does mean I can do a bunch in one turn. Wow. Because you can keep spending force charges mm -hmm. to keep getting action. Because I just did an action, so I could do it again. Oh but, man. I know. He's a bit crazy. Uh, yeah. But does, you know. Does he get them back? He does. In fact, uh, during the end phase, you recover one force charge okay. per ship. So, and Luke could, gets his back on the defense, which is yeah, which is a cool way to as do well. It. Yeah, so he could end up spending two and then recovering two over the course of a turn. Yeah, yeah. or spend yeah, or more. Um, sure. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother um, doing any bonus actions or any of that stuff. Right. So then we go to the engagement phase. Yeah. So we check for Vader. Oh, no targets. Okay. Which Most importantly, though. Yep. To, can Luke hit or not? Oh, nope, not quite. Just out. Just out of range. All right, so, and end then, phase. And of course, Dutch is also. Ah, yes. Mm -hmm. End phase remover are yep. circular tokens. That was another thing I didn't mention earlier, but. Oh, um, yeah. So, as you, as you notice, these are more or less the way they were in first edition. Right. Green circles. But we have added a new color, which is orange. So, orange and green are both temporary tokens. That's when yep. they're both circles. So during the end phase, you remove all circular tokens. Or at the end of the round, you remove the round tokens, as I like to say. Da, da, da. Yeah, clever. That's, that's good. It's good. Uh, you know, <laughs> pneumatic. Oh, pneumatic, right. yeah. Pneumonic, pneumatic. <laughs> <laughs> so we also have jam, which Ooh. is also orange. Yeah. Um, so those both will go away at the end of the round. Uh, focuses would go away, too. Focuses go away. Evades go away. That sort of thing. But target locks. Target are not, locks. Not, uh, target well, target locks, locks are permanent. Permanent. But, and and uh, stress. stress. And ion, which mm -hmm. we also have here, are permanent, and they're this square. more uh, square shape. Yeah, I think they're technically rhombuses. I don't know if they're actually <laughs> square, but whatever. Um, square, squareish. Yeah, squareish. Uh, <laughs> not round. How about that? Non-round. Yes, yeah. I like that. Uh, most accurate. Yeah. So anyway, those are uh, permanent and go away. At, so the cloak token trigger, yeah. was also blue and also a square. Um, it, it goes around when you need it to. Sweet. All right, back to dials. Dial time. I didn't die first turn, yay! Yeah! Okay. Feeling good, feeling good. That's a good start. <laughs> I always like X-Wing because it's, uh, um, when you're moving, it's, like, when you're planning your, your, your turn and your dials, you're like, okay, you gotta think about what my opponent's gonna do, mm -hmm. what am I gonna do, mm -hmm. and then you, you drop your dial on the table. Drop your dial and clumsily. Yeah. yeah, but it's that that, that you know ten seconds of silence where you're like, I don't know what to do. Okay, yeah. 
It, when when commentating, this is always like yeah, the it's, dead zone. It's tricky to do because you're like, what do I talk about now? Yeah, possible maneuvers. Yeah, I don't know. If I was playing as the rebels right now, I think I would be focusing. Yeah. If I was playing, I would shoot the the hero. Yeah, that's what that's my plan. <laughs> John Madden. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> John Madden 2018. To win, to win a game of X-wing. If you want to win X-wing, you gotta blow them up before you get blown up. <laughs> John Madden. Make sure. I mean, he's not wrong. He's not wrong. I did the thing where I was upside down. And you're like, huh. Wait a minute, where's my object? Okay. Where's my arrow? Oh, yeah. wait. All right, dial's All right. down. Yes, let's see. I think that's what I wanted. Yes. Okay. All right. You're up. Let's do it. No system phase jazz. Yep. Um, I'm gonna start with this one. I did a koi gran, which I knew was gonna fit. It's a bit aggressive though, as far as I can't really turn without risking damage. But mm -hmm. this guy does a two turn. Think Boom. We, there we go. I'm in trouble, folks. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. We'll see. Okay. Focus, of course. Yes. Ooh, look at that. It's like you I planned play... it. It's like you planned it. It's like I played this game before. Yeah, yeah. I've got my turret facing that way. Mm -hmm. So I the question think... is, is that range two? Oh. You might need to barrel roll to ensure. I know. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Let's barrel roll right. on a Y wing. Barrel roll on a Y wing. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> All right, folks, first barrel roll. Okay, so sideways here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go barrel roll to the right. Yeah. I think you should fit. I think you'll fit. I, th I think. Okay, so I line up, just to be clear, oh, yeah. with the line, I line that Good. up first. Yep. So that's good, and I, I'm gonna go the back half, right? Uh, you touch the, you line the side on the, there to the front or middle or back okay. of the template. Okay, just like that. Yeah, just like that. Boom. And of course it's a red maneuver. Yes, well, cause you're in a Y-wing barrel rolling, so. You yeah. Know, you gotta, yeah. Sketchy stuff. Yeah, yeah I think you're in, uh, you got in range there. We're gonna eye on some dudes. Woo! All right, uh, Luke is up next. Yes, mm -hmm. and before I activate, I wanna. Open your as well. Yes. So right. before you activate, I do this now, right? Mm -hmm. Just order of operations. Yeah. Okay. So flipping that. Flip. Those wings. I don't need no token. I got that to do. All right. Woo! All right. And then I'm doing a two ahead. <laughs> like I said, flying right into the, the tie, the teeth of the, of to the teeth of the tie. <laughs> this might be a bad call. <laughs> we'll find out. We shall see. The force, right? We're gonna focus. Oh man. So you do have the force which you can spend on defense yes. and you'll get them back. So focusing with a uh, force user isn't as important potentially. Yeah. If you want to shoot those locks, you might want to get a lock, but again, you can also use the force to just instinctive aim instead. So you've got a lot of options. Just yeah, I think I want to use my force on defense, so I think I'm actually going to lock. Okay. Uh, and the reason I want to lock is because I actually want to fire a proton torpedo. Sure. Uh, and I think I'm going to lock the number three guy back there. Number three? Yeah. I think All right. And I check range first, right? Uh, that's when you're attacking. They're gonna okay. Well, for that, I mean for the lock. Oh, for the lock. Yes. If you if you're gonna lock, you can measure range to yeah, all the so ships. I'm gonna, boom. He's yeah, in. sure. No problem there. And then I'm I'm the white uh, numbers. So oh, the black numbers. The white background. But yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Yeah. I know what you meant. <laughs> white background, black numbers. Gotcha. <laughs> and then that's how we do the new target locks. Yes. So. Okay. That was Luke's action. Oh boy. We'll find out if this pays off or not. Mm -hmm. uh, and then sixes go. Yes, sixes go. And I have initiative. Yes. Or well, I am uh, the first player. You are the first player. Wait, so you I are go. the first player. Wait, right? You went first last time. Did we Who has the token? Uh, I had it at the start of last yes. turn. Then you have it forever. So I go. I you go. are the first player. Yeah, okay. Wait, did you want to open your response? Oh, it did. Uh, yes. That's okay. 
It's a friendly game. Yeah. <laughs> I'm learning. This is my first time flying these guys. Come on. <laughs> they have S foils now. This is all new to me. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, firing through an asteroid. I mean, you can uh, shoot this little shot guy. this guy. Yeah, I think I think he is going to focus though. Mm -hmm. um, he is not a force user. He is not a force user. And real quick too, just thinking. Yeah. Uh, you're in my front arc, and I'm not I'm in your firing arc. In, I'm not in. You're not in my front arc. So out maneuver won't trigger. Right. Yes. The poor. Well, you uh, perform a front arc attack if you are not in the defender's firing arc. Yes. So yeah, I can totally. Ooh, that's gonna be bad. Oh yeah. Uh, focus. I think focus, focus is the way is to go. Problem. Yeah. And as I mentioned earlier, I felt good, and then I was like, oh right, but I did plan this maneuver. Okay. I'm gonna bump. But that's okay. Didn't get too much up in the fight. Here's where we're actually gonna. I was just doing this to show off. Yeah, it's showing off. This is all a, uh, learning to <laughs> show stuff off. All right. So I line up the. Yeah, it's great. Name. It is actually a really good example, though. Yeah. The, the, the middle line shows everything, so. There you go. Can I fire at Vader now? Oh. You could. Uh oh. He's the Dark Lord of the Sith, though. Yeah. You know what they say about dealing with Siths? Or something. I don't know. Something you gotta drain them? Oh, that's not the right system. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Lance and Boyd. Oh. <laughs> All right. Okay. Go, engagement phase. Engagement phase. This so, is the first engagement phase for me. So, uh, yeah, um, that we're gonna actually yeah. be rolling dice with. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, which goes first? So which goes you first? can measure uh, range to things. So, for yeah. example, here, you got. I mean, you're in arc range yeah. three. Range. It's real close. Real close. Up oh, range three. All right. It's not so close, actually. And then this guy range three. Yeah. All of those guys. I think I'm gonna go for the not, I mean, Vader's Vader, and I Vader's am worried about him. Yeah. But I think I have a better shot at taking out the squadron, Black Squadron guys, so. Agreed. I'm gonna fire there. So, okay. uh, has, has anything changed in the uh, attack phase here? Uh, not so much. Other than the name. <laughs> yeah, you get uh, three attack dice. Three attack dice. Uh, it's range three, so yeah. I would get a bonus die, yep. but. I'm wedge, and You're I'm wedge. maneuvering. So I lose one, and I lose two. So yep. I'm down to two dice. So here goes. Ooh, Three hits. Brutal. Okay, uh, number four. You got this. He's oh. got this. Oh. He's fine. You got one through. Okay. Right, he's got the one through, so it takes the one damage. So uh, damage decks, one for each player still, mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. and um, again, still face down is... face up. Yep. Yep. Um, one subtle difference about uh, things at the same pilot skill, which I think only would happen if Vader and Wedge actually kill each other. Um, you are not removed until the end of that initiative step. So rather than it being like you linger until you attack, mm -hmm. you actually persist until the end of that engagement, like pilot that, skill. that pilot skill check. Or yeah, the, um, or that initiative. initiative. Yeah. yeah. So it, it helps a little bit with some situations where you didn't want to attack with a guy because as soon as he did, he would disappear, and then his ability doesn't exist for everyone else at right, that right. At that initiative. So it was just. To they kind of last, they last until the end of the initiative step. Yeah, it's trying to represent how everything's happening more or less simultaneously. Right. Because we can't both be rolling the dice, all that things at the same time, one right. of us just has to go first. Right, so. right, right. Anyway. Just, makes sense, makes sense to me. Yeah. Okay, so then Vader gets to shoot. Vader shooting, uh oh. So I could shoot back at Wedge. Could do this really bad shot against Luke. Um, I'm cool with that if you are. <laughs> uh, I think I'm going to go with against Wedge there. Yeah. So we get two attack dice. Unfortunately... Um, I do not have you locked, because if I did, my advanced target computer ship mm -hmm. ability would trigger. Which is, while you perform my primary attack against a defender you have locked, roll one additional attack die and change one hit to a crit. So Ooh. it's reminiscent of the yeah, advanced yeah, target yeah. computer first. So, fortunately, just two dice for me. Boop. Nothing. No re-rolls. Ouch. Nada. And you can't spend your four... Uh, I cannot spend the force, force to affect... It, it only affects focus. It only affects focus results, exactly. Okay. So Now, uh, um, just... From a mechanical standpoint, I know I don't need to roll dice, but would I have to roll dice, or is that? Uh, I mean, you could. In this case, you have no abilities that trigger off of defenses. Right. I don't either. So just to save time, we don't, don't worry about it, it. Okay. Technically, you would, but we don't have to. We don't really. Doesn't matter at this point. Cool. All right, Luke's turn. Yes. I'm gonna fire some torpedoes at him. Oh so boy. We're gonna check range. Mm-hmm. That uh, is. We're definitely in range. Oh yeah. Two. But. Since it uh, does not apply range bonuses, I wouldn't get the die either way. Yeah. 
I just think it's cool to fire torpedoes. Oh, yeah. It's actually... It'll, uh, it'll feel... It's gonna hopefully it should feel good. Yeah. <laughs> now, uh, again, I don't have to spend a lock to shoot it. Correct. Uh, but I do have to spend a charge. Yep. So I'm going to flip my charge from active to inactive. Mm -hmm. And I just roll my four dice, right? You sure do. And you change one hit to crit. So it's a similar dice modify. You could reroll that blank if you spend the lock. Uh, I might as well because... Yeah. Sure. Why not? Why not? Ha ha! Okay. Now, now I have choices. Use the force. Yes, I'm gonna use the force because why not? Why not? And then I'm gonna use uh, the uh, ability that's innate for protons mm -hmm. to change a hit to a crit. So we'll there do two go. hits and two crits. And then you spend the one uh, force charge for one with force as well. charge. Do these flip over? Yep. Yeah. Cool. So hit, hit, crit, crit. Yikes. Uh -oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Luke. Very dead. Very dead. But now he can't make his Death Star run, so it's kind of a win for you. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I should draw these one at a time. Um, console fire and stabilizer. Doesn't really matter here because I'm not going to get turn fire. I'm going to be dead. So anyway. But so, he sticks around until the end of he, initiative five. Initiative five, exactly. Yeah. Which no one else is attacking. Then so. we remove all the dead chips. Yep. You're right. That did feel pretty good. Right? <laughs> good thing you spent it because yeah. it got discarded anyway. Yeah. All right. Okay. Poor guy. Poor guy. Uh, now we go to Dutch. Yes, your initiative four. Okay, so um, you're not my front arc, obviously, mm -hmm. but uh, you are my side arc, which is where I have my ion cannon turret Indeed. positioned. And it's range so, one to two. Yep, so you can certainly shoot at this guy. I think that's my best bet. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is a three die attack. Yep. Um, has ion changed at all? Is that? It has a little bit, as you'll see, the way it's the damage is dealt. But okay. Um, also, the number required, so it requires one to ion as a small ship, two for medium, and three for a large. Oh, yeah, because so there's medium ships now. There's medium ships now. All right. So large ships got a little bit better against ion. Uh, you'll see, depending on how the damage is dealt, because every damage beyond the first deals ion tokens. Oh, okay. So let me see what happens. Let's roll. Yeah. Oh! Ooh. Whiff town. No Whiff locks, stuff. no nothing. Nothing. So. Okay, but uh, just, just, and then you roll yours. But, uh, so, real quick, too, the sure. Iron Cannon, if this attack hits, you spend one hit or a crit result to cause the defender to suffer one damage. Mm -hmm. All remaining hits or crits uh, inflict Ion tokens instead of damage. Yeah. So Ions do damage, and then any extra damage becomes Ion. Yes. So, so it, it, it's able to <laughs> kind of, uh, yeah, so it does both effects. So if you're hitting a really slow-moving target, which most large ships tend to have low sure. agility, you'll probably be able to do more Ion to them. Oh, yeah. It's um, a neat little change. Yeah, I think so. Uh... Yeah. So, anyway, unfortunately, did not get no. to do any ionization. <laughs> well, for, for, for me, for you. but not you. <laughs> All right, so let's do, I'll just do this attack next with this Black Squadron here. Where's that going to go? I think I'm going to go against Luke here. Okay, so I have become the defender. You have. So I recover one force, is that correct? Uh, yes, so you recover one force charge. Sweet. All right, so I'm going to roll my two dice because they're range two here. Yep. Boop. Oh no! Um, I guess no other attacks are coming, so I might as well spend it. Yep. Cool. I've got two agility, so I'm rolling my two agility dice. Mm -hmm. I get All one right. evade. One, you're good. So oh, speaking I, of evade, real fast. Yeah. Too, um, and we mentioned this earlier. Mm -hmm. Evade changed, right? Evade tokens. Yeah. The evade tokens changed. So you can spend an evade token to change a result to an evade. So if you only have, if you have three agility, you can't get four evade results. Mm -hmm. But you could more likely get those three evades. Yeah. And that helps out with uh, ships that do have a four die attack or something like that. Mm -hmm. You just can't get more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. So actually, before you uh, oh. remove those, I can trigger <coughs> a crack shot because I managed to get you in my bullseye. Barely, oh, but in there. Yep. So. <coughs> oh, excuse me. No worries. Uh, so yeah, uh, while you perform a prey attack, the defender's in your bullseye arc. Before neutralize result step, which no. is where we do this, you can spend it to cancel your crit or your vein. So I spent it. Goes away. Lose a shield. Lose a shield. <coughs> All right. I'm going to do that again with this uh, other black squadron ace, who also has you in his bullseye. No! I suspected you might be in that rough area of the board. <laughs> Bullets, my <laughs> one weakness. <laughs> Actually, they're lazy. Whatever. <laughs> All right. Uh, I got focus crit here. I'll spend my focus. Oh, and now it's hit crit. Come on, Luke. Oh wait, I'm, I was a defender, but you I didn't would spend recover, any. but you don't yeah. have any. So Luke's ability triggers every time. Every he gets time. Wow. Yeah. Ah. Aha. I'm gonna totally use that. Okay. I'm gonna use a force to change that to a to, to evade. evade. However, I will crack shot once again. 
So I will cancel one of those evades. Yep. And then one crit against a shield. Yep. Lose both your shields. No shields for Luke. Now you're in a position. If only I had a way for somebody to give me shields back. <laughs> if only you could recover shields. <laughs> yes. So that's it. Okay. Because unfortunately, this guy was just sort of a, a bummer. He yeah. Blocked Vader and didn't get a shot. Whoops. Mistakes. Uh, does he have a shot at Dutch at all? Or? No, I just measured that one. It's, okay. It's so. a, little, a little far. Okay. So, so far, this feels very similar to uh, uh, first previous season. edition, first mm -hmm. edition, but there are some tweaks and changes. I'm liking it so far. Good. It's, uh, it's, it's definitely feeling like, uh, it feels like X-Wing. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Right. I feel like we did a, a, a very good job of making it still be X-Wing, but just tuned up a lot of the parts that were uh, a little loose, if you will. Yeah, yeah. Uh, do you recover force tokens only um, uh, during the end phase? During the end phase. Yeah, so you would recover one during the end phase. Okay, so that does come back. Mm -hmm. But shields don't. Shields don't. <laughs> Charges don't. Charges don't. Yep. Unless they have a little recurring symbol. So you see that little uh, arrow, the little diamond next to the, the two there yeah. on the charge? Um, uh, some upgrades actually have that next okay. to that on those cards. Just as so well. the folks can see what we're talking sure. about here real quick. Me. Show. Yeah. This uh, this little diamond right there on the card. So. Yeah. So some uh, cards with standard charges also have that symbol to denote that they recur as well. So cool. that's why you can do one of those once per round abilities because you can just recover one a turn mm -hmm. around me. Then you land on it. I'm gonna Don't do get something to attack. probably that's gonna get me laughed at, but let's do it. <laughs> See what happens. It might work. I don't might. know. Would you like to drop your seismic charge? Can I do that with a a stress? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Yeah, let's do it just just because I want to see what happens. Sure. Okay. Seismic charge. It's got to go one out the back. Still, mm -hmm. right? So you're gonna drop it, which means it goes out the back. Yep. Place it right there. Boom. Yep. Okay. All right. Vader has a uh, ability I can trigger during the system phase, but oh, you know what? I think I'm actually gonna do it. Uh oh. So. Since, during the system phase, you may choose one ship at range 0 to 1 and look at its dial. If you spend one force charge, you may choose a ship at range 0 to 3 instead. Ooh. So, as you may have caught there, range 0 is a new concept, yeah. which basically means if you're touching them. Mm -hmm. So, instead of having to say, you can have differentiate between range 1 and touching bumping, yeah, instead, yeah. Of, instead of it being both. So, anyway, I'm actually going to look at Wedge's dial. <laughs> I do, I'm curious to see what I need to do to block you. Oh, man. So, spend my gonna, force charge. He's going to laugh. It's going to be okay. All right. I'm going to peek. You can show the camera because... Oh, he's doing a... Th Ooh, three talent to the right. Yeah. Fascinating. All right. Good gonna, to know. I'm going to clip it. I might as well... Sure. Do know. it in style. Yeah. I like it. Okay. Well, that's the system phase. Activation phase. Let's start with this guy. He's going to do a little too straight. Potentially bumping Luke or or not. That's okay. Clog it up. Clog it up. Is this range one? That is the question. But if I barrel roll, I'm just gonna have to deal with that asteroid. Mm -hmm. And I don't really want to deal with that. Um, I think I'm gonna just suck it up and hope I'm out of range. And I'll just focus. You could barrel roll into range, that would help Oh, me yeah! No. Then I know I'm in range. Yeah, yeah. Then it's not Just make it a guarantee. No yeah. no questions in my mind. Yeah. All right, this guy's going to do a three turn. Ooh. Here we go again. Might range one of that. I'm definitely range one of that one. But, do I care? I think the answer is maybe yes. Probably be able to shoot at Dutch, but 
If I do get ionized, I'm not going to a good place. Mm -hmm. It might be worthwhile to bear roll in this instance. Tricky. Um, sure. Let's do it. Get away from the explosion, too. If I'm lucky, it might be able to uh, have an obstructed attack, yeah. but probably not. <coughs> I think you went slower than that. Oh. All right. I'm going to go to this guy here. Did a two bank, which is blue. Oh, man. What is going on here? Bad day. Shameful. Shameful. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Indeed. <laughs> so it takes damage. Of course he does. You know Ty's and asteroids are Oof. it's just a bad time for them. Oof, this is <laughs> pathetic. That guy's not he's not coming back next next uh, I mean he blocked Vader game. and then he got hit and yeah. then he an asteroid. He's, yeah. Go back to the academy. You're he's drunk. fine from the spot. That's the wingman who's unforced error since <laughs> Vader. Oh yes. <laughs> In the trench room. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then he then crashes into the wall. Yeah. <laughs> One ahead. I wanted to do that to clear the stress. Also, Mm -hmm. because my turret was facing that side. Yeah. Luke! Ah, 4K! Perfect. It's like you knew I I was going to do that. Ah, unfortunately he can't shoot, but um, otherwise he'd be in a great position. All right, so I'm going to do a little one of these tricks. Yeah. So I just need to make sure I do it again on the other side. Mm-hmm. Oops. Oh, good. Oh, good. He was. He didn't matter. It's fine. All right. <laughs> it's just Vader. It's just Vader. Yep. Oh, ships. Totally gonna bump. Yes. Boop. Bloopity bloop. It's because he barrel rolled into me. Uh huh. Takes the stress. Yep. Actually, wait, we can double check where Vader is positioned. Let's see. Because he was right there and bumped into him, so he's about there. Yeah. Okay. Space man, it's wrinkle in time or whatever. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Okay. Uh, then I'm you first player. First player. All right. That crazy talent. <laughs> so much like the bear roll that we spoke of earlier, you get to pick one of the three final positions. Okay. To, uh, so that all changed to oh that yep. Okay. So yep, you'll turn around. Let's see. And so you can basically align it as this way, this way, or this way. That's yes. where you're going to be. Then you take a stress. I want to be maybe damage. over here. Okay. Yeah. Stress, roll for damage. Yes. Oh. Oof. Yeah. Takes a shield. All right. Then we have Veda doing a one straight. Just crawling in. Again, the maneuver you didn't expect from a tie advanced. <laughs> the slowest of maneuvers. All right. Well, I would like to target lock. Yeah. I'm going to target lock Luke there. Bad times for Luke. Uh, two. Yep. It's fine. Now, Luke, knowing that he would not have any shots this round, could have recovered ah, a shield. Good point. As you knew you were going to bump. Before you did it, is that that's, uh, that's the, new art, the new art? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. I thought again, it's not an game. action. Go for it. Okay, cool. I didn't realize that wasn't an action. Mm-hmm. Okay, so that just flips over. Get a shield. Yes. And a disarm. Is there a disarm token yeah. there? All right. Peter is going to lock him. I'm used to R2 causing you to, you know, do mm-hmm. other things. So it's it, it's different. It's different. Yeah. Different game, guys. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So yeah, I'm not gonna use Vader's ability to do more stuff. That's Vader. So go to combat phase. Yeah. Wedge has no shot. No. No. Um, Vader does though. So Vader will perform a cluster missile attack against Luke. Is that range two? Um, actually, do I even care? So normally, the advantage of Cluster Missile is I can perform a bonus attack against a different target. Yeah. I don't have to have a lock on that person. But no other ship is at range 1 to 2. Yeah, yeah. So, since I have a Luke, a, va- a, Luke, a lock on Luke, <laughs> um, if I just do a primary attack, I will also be rolling 3 dice because yeah. I get to do that. So, you know what? I'm going to forego the Cluster Missiles yeah, yeah. and just regular shoot him. I also get to change a hit to a crit. Uh, I'm going to get oh, some yeah. more stuff. Sorry. Oh, yeah. 
do this. I'll use um, my fire control system while I perform an attack. If you have a lock on the defender, you may reroll one attack die. If you do, you cannot spend your lock. So that's what okay. fire yeah. control system worked this time. So I'll reroll this guy. Yep. I will reroll it again. <laughs> now now right. it's good. Then I'll spend the force. Yes. Three hits. Three hits. <laughs> one of them being a crit. Yes. Okay, so nasty, I rolled. Nasty attack. I get one focus. Oof. I think yep. I'm going to have to spend y one. Yeah, you should definitely one. do that. Yeah. So, and then that'll block one. Shield mm -hmm. will block one. Then you take a crit. Uh-oh. Shield. <clears throat> crit is... Lose stabilizer. R2, fix that stabilizer. <laughs> All right, it's after you execute a non-straight maneuver, suffer one damage and repair this card. Action, repair this card. So, uh, yeah, that's not so. Ooh. That's not so nice. Oh yeah, you can spend that force charge. Oh yeah. Um, oh, I did. I had. Oh, two. oh yes, he did. Uh, yeah, so we'll give you the critical damage marker to track. Look at all those things you've got. Oh wow. He's having a he's having a rough time. I was just showing off all the tokens I could get in one turn. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I think you went from uh, zero to four. <laughs> That's, um, yeah, so that could be rough. you got to keep mm -hmm, going mm -hmm. straight or else this loose stabilizer will yep. break off. And Luke has no shot. Keep, also true. Going to, going to Dutch. Going to Dutch. All right, Dutch. Let's oh, do this. Oh, huh. Totally forgot this. Yeah, when does that happen? It was the end of the activation phase. Okay, so it would have triggered. It would have yeah. triggered. So, uh, unfortunately, Dutch is still in range yeah, of yeah, it. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, yeah. So when it goes off, you choose an obstacle in range one. That um, one. Um, everyone in range one takes one damage, so you take a damage. And yep, I got did a shield. I accurately guess. Oh, I did. I Just out, out of range. Uh, and then the debris is also this removed. This is gone now, right? Yeah. It was, a, it was a gamble. That's all right, Dutch. But now you got your ion. So let's yeah. uh, let's do this ion. So the guy you've locked, imagine. Yeah. Let's get a range two there. Maybe you'll clip the. Uh, yeah. If I get lucky. Yeah, I think I. We'll see. I we'll might see. be. You might be just out of it. Yeah. Okay. Three shots. Mm -hmm. Three dice. Three dice. With Here we lock. go. With a lock. So you could spend them. Uh, yeah, I should spend them. Yeah. So reroll both of these because I have no focus. So. Mm -hmm. Ah, Ooh, same thing. Still one. Still one. I should mathematically be able to block this, and I do. Yep. Alright. No! Okay. On to my three. That's it. Because no shot here. He's unfortunately on an asteroid, although he has a great shot! He does! And then, do I have one in arc here? I think the answer is no. Yeah. No shots. Woof! Well, fortunately, Vader's on my team. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Okay. So, end phase. We both recover force charge. Your force charge. Um, uh, we will remove this guy. Yep. So I don't have a shot. Don't mm -hmm. have focus. Okay. Moving on, top of the round. Yes, back to the planning phase. All right. You just watch this this sad sap academy pilot who is, claims to be a black squadron ace will be an ace in the end. <laughs> He's gonna ace everybody. Yeah. He's kill everything. Okay. <laughs> All right. System phase. I don't have any ion uh, seismic charge. Oh, oh I, do, I, do, I do, I do. You do have one, one left. You could drop it. I don't There's recommend nothing, it. Yeah, no, no. Um, all right. Uh, I can use sense, and I might as well. I, sure. Let's yeah. see what Wedge is up to. He's going to be doing a two-turn. Oh. Because I got the R4. The R4. Mm. Yeah. Interesting. Good to know. Yeah. All right, then we'll move on to my threes. This guy's gonna do a three straight. Or you'll block him. Or I'll block him, especially if I... Ooh, what'd you do? What did I do? Do I barrel roll? What did I do? <laughs> yes. I think I'm gonna barrel roll, because I might block you. Because I don't think I'm gonna get an attack with him anyway yeah. against Dutch. Dutch has to do a crazy fast move, and then I'm just gonna get shot in return. Or I'll either deny an attack. Actually, I could go back far if I want. Mm -hmm. Sure. I'm going to stick with this straight straight one. All right. That's that. Okay. Um, let's go do this guy next. He did a three turn. Bum, bum, bum. Ah, here we can use our fancy. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, how do you have two? What happened here? Uh, I didn't spend uh, oh, Dutch's. Oh, uh -huh. Yeah, one of those Wait, was on Luke this from is Vader. One. You have one from Vader? 
Yes, but why are they, why are they both ones? Because uh, I have a one Dutch and you have oh, a one you beer. Oh, you do have a one Dutch. <laughs> Too true. Too true. And I didn't pull it when I spent it. Ah, yes. Right, I'll hold this one. Sure. Okay. So, after that, he did not touch that again. So he gets an action. He will focus. Now he can focus. <laughs> he was uh, not focused earlier. <laughs> no. All right. This guy's going to do a three bank. And because our uh, psychic friend, Darth Vader, um, I know where you're going to be. Yeah, you do. I do. It's a two turn. So two turn will basically have you bump me. Unfortunately, I can't target lock you. This would be a great time to target lock you. Mm -hmm. um, theoretically, I could barrel to the left and maybe get a shot, but you could boost or barrel. Oh, but mm -hmm. mm, tricky, tricky. Sure, let's do it. Love those barrels. They're just so fun. They are fun. It's one of my favorite maneuvers. Maneuvers are a different thing. Yeah. <laughs> One All of right. my favorite actions, yeah. Yes. All okay. right. Trickiness of uh, multiple words that mean the same thing. All right. Synonyms. Yeah. Dutch. Bank. I banked. All so right. if I didn't barrel, I might have had a shot on you with him. I know. Turns out. OK. We're going to do the fancy. Do the, do yeah, yeah, let's do that. Sure. Dutch is flying the keep your enemies on the right tactic. Yeah, it's a good one. <laughs> yeah, I think if I didn't barrel, I might have blocked you. I think he should... Let's target lock again for the reroll. Sure. And we're going to target lock the, the guy other, that I have. Uh... The sad... Uh... Oh. Whoops. Oh, I just want to grab sad little academy tilot. <laughs> Academy Tyler, Pilot, Tyler, Pilot, Tyler? Yeah, I did just say Tyler. It's okay. It is. All right. Would you uh, like to recover a shield? Uh, can I do that now? It's when because you really of uh, R2. Yes, I would like to recover a shield. Fortunately, with your loose stabilizer, you're going to take damage since you didn't do an on yeah, straight. So. But it's going to repair. Yes. So. Which just flips it over to regular damage, right? Uh, it'll just take that shield off again. Because it, you'll suffer one damage. Yeah, it says uh, one damage and repair the this card. So repair just means yeah, to flip, flip it. it that's over. what I mean. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. So I'll take the damage on the shield, which mm -hmm. is fine, and then you can well, move this fine, guy. Yep. And then this goes right too. Yep. It's... And I'm still locked. Still locked. Uh, do I, I get an action though now? Right. You do. I want to set up for future turns. Sure. So I think I'm going to target lock. Okay. I'm lock. Sure. And you gonna lock? I'm going to lock? Oh, wait, 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 wait a minute. Dutch has the ability. When he acquires lock, you found the ship at range one, two, three. Yeah, you could have done that. Let's yeah. say you did. Sure, yeah. I can only hold one lock anyway. Mm -hmm. So uh, Luke, Luke's lock. Mm -hmm. We'll be on the same guy because he was in three. Sure. And then um, I'll focus, even though I've got. Uh, that's fine. you got yeah. force powers, but that's. Force powers. You might want to save him for other stuff. Yeah. All right. Seems good. Then your uh, wedge goes next. Wedge. This is two turn. Yes. Do two turn. Do that for you if you like. Yes, please. And it's uh, because of the R4 Ashramek, it's a one to two basic maneuver, so it becomes a blue maneuver. Mm -hmm. And I lose the stress, mm -hmm. which is what I needed. And now then. Yeah, I think we. I might have bumped you instead. That's true. Yeah. Um, barrel. I think I'm going to boost as his action. Wait, I don't have boost. I have to do the S foil thing. Yes, you had to close your wings. Yeah. Okay. I'm not gonna do that. Uh, he's gonna focus then. Sure. I think focus is a good call. All right. Oh, you can put it on the next. To the oh, yeah. yeah. Sorry. No worries. Yeah. And Veda. It's gonna one bank to the right. Do you have the maneuver the other guy tried to do without mm. hitting it? So you just need to go one bang instead of two. Yeah. Then you'd be fine. All right, so uh, the Dark Lord of the Sith here is going to do a barrel. Oh, no. 
I'm going to just use the native linked actions that I have available to me. Yeah, how do those work? So I'm going to perform a focus action. Then, because I have the linked action of red barrel, I can do a red barrel afterwards. Now you get a stress because it's a red barrel roll, correct? Yes. So you can't do, you can't spend focus to do more actions mm -hmm. because you took a stress. Right. Yeah. Which is fine. I wouldn't really have much else to do anyway. Yeah. I already have you locked, etc. Yeah. So. <laughs> it's true. It's true. <laughs> so I'll take a stress to do that. And right. now you don't have a, a asteroid shot at Luke. Now you have a, a regular shot Just at Luke. Just a regular. Yeah. Potentially range one. We'll see. I think, I think it's range two. Yeah. But either way. All right, combat phase. Combat. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Is this range one? No, it's range two. That's fine. Still get three dice. Yeah. Still have two defense. <laughs> okay, Luke. And you you have recovered two shields already. I, I yeah. Well, I guess technically we should have this, but we we knew you weren't gonna get any attacks. Yeah. But for consistency. Claim defense. Oh. Ouch. Ouch. And then because advanced targeting computer, mm -hmm. turn on the extra nastiness. Two crits. All right, Luke, do your stuff. Use the force, Luke. <gasps> oh, I can't use the force. I'm totally gonna use, uh, am I gonna get shot again? No. It doesn't really matter in this case. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna go ahead. And... Use the force for fun. Yeah. You're gonna recover it anyway. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> so. All right, a Two single damage. crit gets through. Womp, womp, womp. Double damage. Could be. Pilot wounded, uh-oh. That's Wounded pilot. After you perform an action, roll it one attack die. On a hit or crit, stress token, action repair this card. Mm. Yeah, so as you see here, a lot of the actions have the ability to repair it, but they're kind of nasty. Yeah, yeah. Um, rather than having any dice roll, maybe it fixes. They just usually fix if they give you the option to do so. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. But yeah, they, they are pretty not nice. And they might have ways to essentially self-repair, as in... Yeah. At least I got my proton torpedo shot. I'm happy. Yeah, right? <laughs> It just blew him up immediately. It was pretty sweet. Uh, <laughs> All right. Okay, moving um, on. Dutch. Uh, yeah, well, Luke doesn't oh, have Luke a shot. Oh, Luke has no shot. Crew. Uh, where and couldn't going? anyway, because he's yeah, just on. Yep. So, yeah. so Dutch. Dutch. Mr. Consistency. Range one. Get Range four one. dice. I get four dice with an iron king. Woo! I enter. Woo! All right, here we go. Come on, Dutch. Dutch. Oh, good <laughs> thing you have a lock. But I do have a lock. Woo! Okay. I'm just going to reroll it. Yeah, sounds good. And I'm going to spend my lock this time. Which yeah, is, actually, did, yeah. actually use good, that. Good, so. good. work. Ho! Okay. Two well. hits. More than none. Yep. Let's see if this is enough to kill him. I mean, this guy's pretty injured. Yeah, He's yeah. He's had a rough go of it so far. Some of it's self-inflicted, inflicted, you know. Oh, that's true. All right, need some paint. Show me some paint. There we go. Spend the focus. Oh! Whew. Somehow, Dutch. Oh. Somehow. Dodging those iron blasts. Point blank. Oh. Oh. Yep. All right. Um, yep, and as I said before, Matt got out of arc here. Out of arc here. But get a range one shot. In retaliation. Had to spend the focus. So yep, it is yep. unmodified. But I could get lucky. And I do have crack shot still on this guy. Oh, man. He was clumsy and had not lined up any <laughs> attacks. Although, I can't use it. Yeah, but because not in my bullseye. Not in my bullseye. All right, Ooh. hit crit. Oh! A single crit. Yep. So and I got a shield still. That's your last so. shield. Bum, bum, bum. So as you saw, our, uh, the hit whole shield ratio adjusted a little bit since mm -hmm. first edition. So it used to be 5-3, now it's 6-2. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So we're playing up the allowing you to actually resolve crit effects yeah, more, yeah. more often. So. A, sh a ship with more shields is going to feel... You'll be able to feel it more. You'll be, you get the crit. Crits become more of a thing instead of just... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Gone. Yeah. So. I, I noticed that, too. In first edition, when you, you typically by the time you're taking crits, you're pretty much dead anyway. Yeah. So, so you wanted like, to play yeah. that out a little bit. I mean, uh, even with the X-Wing, it has an extra yeah. hull. Yeah. Well, that's four it. Four two is nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Uh, that's the end of the round. So you remove all the okay. round tokens. And right. Back to dials. Okay. Do have another seismic charge. 
I do. Mm. I do. Mm-hmm. I do like you can do it twice. That's yeah, I, I like the, uh, the 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 charges on the ordnance. Let's use it more than just one one shot. Because mm -hmm. obviously, like this one, uh, it was my bad. But um, <laughs> yeah. But now it's gone. Like not yeah. having it on the boards, uh, noticeable. Yeah, totally. So, system phase. System phase. I want to drop a charge. Okay. So. There's a little one here. It's a from the side there. I have flipped the charge already. And that just I goes. Just do, I can lean it. Not that it matters because yeah. it's this guy, but that's fine. Cool. Yep. All right. Okay. That's yours, actually. Oh, yes. And uh, sister phase, I'm not going to sense. Um, Are you sure? Yes. Oh, I did recover this. <laughs> yep, we both recovered uh, one. Hmm. Cause you're range two, I'd have to spend two. Look at yeah. his or wedges. Mm. That's fine. Hey, why not? Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> You've got it. I mean that's the new cool new sure, thing. Let's do it. Wedge. Okay. What you doing, Wedge? Wedge is doing a three, three turn. Three turn. Yeah. Okay. Trying to get him back in the fight here. Yeah, I wasn't sure if you're gonna try to just solo this little guy or not. Good to know. Thought about it, but I don't have a backup maneuver, so <laughs> no reverse. <laughs> Boy, yeah, that reverse would be so nice right Man. now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So I'm gonna start with this guy. 4K! 4K! 4K Miho! 4K! We right. usually say that around the office too whenever oh, yeah. we do a 4K. 4K! <laughs> or whatever the number is. Yeah. 2K! 2K! <laughs> 2K! All right. Yeah, that's all that he does. Mm -hmm. This guy is going to do a one turn. I suspected you would do as much, but in case you mm -hmm. didn't... Yeah, I was almost going to correct Ooh. and just do a two instead, but mm -hmm, I was like, mm -hmm. I can just do this. It's similar, yeah. It's similar, but just I could have focused in case you didn't yeah. drop it. And knowing you're doing a three turn, I can't do anything with that information. I mean, I could try, <laughs> try to barrel roll, I suppose, yeah. um, to re-angle myself. So here's an instance where I think in first edition I might have been able to fit in front of you. Mm. But because of the way the template places, yeah. I cannot. Um, I think I'll just focus boringly. <laughs> okay, starting with Dutch. Uh, this doesn't go until later, so yep. I'm just going to go ahead and do it. Oh, one straight. Are we going to bump? Probably bump. Maybe. Oh, I think you did. Uh-oh. Boop. Yep. Bumped it. Dang it. I was going to use an action to put my turret in the back, and mm -hmm. it was going to be cool. Oh. Yep. That's why I can't turn in front of you. Yep, yep. I get no action now. That's true. Womp womp. Okay. Uh, Luke. Mm-hmm. Luke. Are you going to open, close? I think I want to go ahead. I want the option to... Uh, Boost if I can. Sure. So, and close those guys for you. Yeah. And he is doing. A... Do you want to cover shield? Oh yes, a, a last one. Last so, one. Yeah. You're doing a two to the right. Looks like. Yes. All right. Would you like to? What action would you like to do? Wait a minute. If any. That was. Not supposed to be a two to the right. Oh, that was supposed to be the town roll. That's okay. Oh, the town. Yeah, I, was I mean, you could have done that. Nah, it's it's fine. I, right. I think it just shifted, but no, nope, mm. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with that. I'm okay. Gonna, yeah, that's okay. That would have been cool. That would have been cool. Yeah. You know, for cool's sake, I'm okay if you did the other one. I really did have it set to a town roll, but I think it shifted. But uh, yeah, because it would be the town to the right, It'd be over here. Yes, I wanted to. Go. Yeah, I. I yeah. You want, do you want to be over here instead? Facing that way? Because that's what you, your town roll. Yeah, would have gone that instead. way. Is that what you meant? No. Oh. <laughs> I wanted a town roll oh. over here, okay. but 
No, yeah, it's that's over there. Yeah, that's okay. We're just gonna leave it because yeah. I really did have it set, but I totally screwed up the sides because <laughs> that's all right. Ugh. I'm not used to talent rolling with T65. It's, that's what it is. Yeah, it's there all, you go. It's definitely not me being rusty. I like it. I like it. Okay, uh, so, yeah. uh, so I action. did the thing though. You I haven't performed an action yet. No actions yet. Uh, you could repair could that. Repair it. Yeah. I got my shield back, mm -hmm. which I desperately need. Uh huh. Um, am I gonna get a shot this turn? Probably not. Well, if you recover shield, then you doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. So, um, I I think I'm gonna go ahead and just repair it. Sure. So I don't take the damage. Mm -hmm. Just gonna do that. or the stress. Stress. Yeah. yeah. All right. He's flying around in the school days. Uh, first player. So. <laughs> yep. Three turn. Three turn. It's like I'm psychic or something. <laughs> Did you sense that? <laughs> I will target lock Vader. Ooh, boy. Yeah. Do I want to target lock or focus? I don't know. What mm. do you think he's going to be? Not that it'll matter too much. Unless I talent roll to face you. I can't. I'm stressed. Yeah. That's all the ruse. <laughs> Let's go ahead and target lock while I got the opportunity. Right, let's next do that. So. Sure. Let's start there. Okay. I did another tiny one. Pink. Whoops. Oh, good. Oh, good. Now we'll never know where there's going to bump. I don't think it was, but we'll see. Oh. Very close. Very close. Or I messed it up and I was going <laughs> to hit you. But I think I was going to miss. I was looking at, I was eyeing up earlier. Yeah, I'm yeah. pretty good about it. Okay, so right now I'm locked on... You're locked on Luke. Luke. And I have no shots on anyone, so I should definitely fix that. Mm -hmm. Um... So, I can't barrel to the right. I can barrel to the left, but then I'm making that attack not obstructed anymore. I'm okay with that. <laughs> but I can certainly hammer on wide, on Dutch, yeah. which is important. So I think I'm going to barrel to the left. I feel like the Rebels are very tanky. Like, uh, I'm, I'm flying very poorly, mm. and you're capitalizing on it pretty well, but I'm not dead yet, so... <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. Let's see here. So... For trickiness sake, yeah, I am going to start with target lock. Okay. Then I am going to use my ability to perform an action. I will focus. Okay. And then I will barrel roll with my linked barrel roll. Wow. Yeah. Doing all the things. It is great. It is great. <laughs> Takes the stress. Yep, yep. Okay. So, unfortunately, I did line mm -hmm. you up with that wedge shot. I get to shoot first. You do. Oh, snap. All right, range probably two, maybe three. I think that's a three. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So I normally would get four, but yeah. I only get two. I get my two shot, or three shots. Mm -hmm. Here we go, some good old outmaneuver and wedges ability. Mean. Hey, uh, burn my target lock. Sure. Might as well. Oh, you get a focus out of it, which doesn't help too much, but Not really. <sighs> it doesn't matter. Yeah. Use my shields. Yeah, I did something. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then Vader is going to shoot at Dutch there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That is a range one shot, I believe. Oh, yeah. Yes. So I'll get two dice plus one. Plus one because of my advanced starting computer. Four I'm going to get one hole of aid here. Or uh -huh. agility die. Right. Then I will re-roll with uh, target fire control system. Yep, yep. And Ooh. because of uh, advanced target computer, make a crit. He's nasty. That is mean. Isn't that mean? No shield. super mean. This could be the end. Oh, wait. The size of oh. me charge. Oh, that... Oh, yes. Keep forgetting. Uh, You're right. So, Vader would have had taken... A damage. A damage. And I think that's it. Yeah. Yes. So these are just going right? Yep. Okay. So I will deal myself damage. Yep, yep. We'll retroactively. Oof. I got a damage there with bombs, but I just good. took a face truck of damage. All right, you so sure did. one of Hit, one at crit, time. crit, crit. So do them one at a time because there are so some hit. crits that matter. Oh, or crits or hit first? I forget. Hits first. Hits first. So Armada's crits first. Yes. One, two hits. Oh, nope. Three crits. 
Oh. Yeah. So one hit. Yes. Crit. Damage sensor ray. All right. So that's the... Uh, you cannot perform any actions except focus and end and actions from damage cards. Ouch. Yep. Uh, fuel leak. After you suffer one crit, suffer one Ooh. hit and repair this card. Mm -hmm. Does that happen immediately? Yeah. That's okay. why it matters. So you're going to suffer another crit here. So I suffer the crit. Ba-boom. Okay. Uh, disable the power regulator before you engage one ion token. Mm. Uh, okay. Right. And, and then, then I take another you hit. took one from fuel that from fruit fuel leak gave you this next damage. Yeah. So. And then fuel leak repairs. So you down. are at one health. Yeah. And you do have the disabled power rate, and so mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that triggers now because we have Luke has no shot. Luke has no shot. Already attacked, of course. Dutch engages. Yep. And so now he receives an ion. Ion token. Ouch. And then it. The. After you execute the ion maneuver, which will be next turn, yep. it'll repair. Yep. So, not super great. But nope. he does get to attack. I think I have to shoot Vader. Poor injured Vader, yeah. Yeah. Poor old Vader. Poor Vader. Now it's range one, though, right? It is. So, uh, uh, yeah. As we measured before. Four dice. Yeah. Four dice again. All right, Dutch, this is, your, this is your chance to make up for everything you've done wrong. <laughs> Not bad. That's two. Let's do two. two. Come on. There we go. Oh, man. Put green dice. Yep. There they are. That's what you say when they're nice. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what would I have done without you? All right. Taking damage. <laughs> Range two with that uh, black squadron. Yep. Ace. Let's see if I can finish off Dutch. They came from behind. They came from behind. No, Unavoidable. It's not matter. It's totally oh, I totally Perfectly. Mm -hmm. Oh, Dutch. Mm. Red Squad, make your attack roll. <laughs> <laughs> he is toast. I still deal the damage, right? So Yes. Just so technically we wouldn't remove this until after the other guy attacks, but it doesn't matter yeah. because of abilities. He can shoot him too, just for fun. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's it. Uh, this guy, I think, is out of arc. Yep, and that's it. Okay. Well, I don't have to worry about that Y-Wing anymore. Yeah. Messing me up anymore, so... <laughs> All right. Yeah, he was, he was throwing you off. Dutch yeah, was, uh, totally. That's the problem. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got a, I got a perfectly fine wedge. I'm taking a shield, so he's... All right, wedge, do your thing. Save the day. System phase. System phase. Um, sure, I'll look at Luke's dial, because I'm a range one, why not? Yeah. Oh yeah, speaking of which, go for a charge. Force charge. Um Yep. So Luke, what you, what you doing this turn? You're gonna what be doing? 4K! Yep. 4K! 4K 4K! Well of course, because you wanna shoot me. I mean, I'm hoping. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense. Alright, start with this guy. Does a three straight. This guy is going to do a two turn. And this guy is going to do a three turn. Okay, make that turn a little sharper. So, Luke, you want to. Okay, oh, yes. 4K! 4K! Wait, did you want to open your S files? Uh, yeah, actually, I did this turn because I can't. Oh, you didn't have a lock to do the torpedo. No. Well, I guess you did on that guy, right? No, that's yeah. Wedge. Uh, Wait, no, that's Luke's. That's Luke's. Either way. Yep. I guess that's mine. But whatever. All right. And Wedge. Mm. 
So, totally got uh, blindsided because I just missed the asteroid. That's so, okay. I th- you I think hit it'll it. be okay. But you could barrel. Yeah, I th- I'm totally going to barrel roll. <laughs> you could. Uh, probably should. Yeah. Which way, though? I mean, probably the way. Because... Ooh. Which way is Vader going? That's the question, yeah. If only you could have seen what I was going to do. Oh, man. <laughs> well, you have to go that direction, but you can use a bunch of force powers to move. If I barrel roll to the left, I will take a shot, and it'll be close range at this guy. Mm-hmm. And he's pretty banged up, right? He sure is. Yeah. You know what? Let's go for the... Let's do it. Go for the throat. Go for the throat. Barrel roll. So line that up first, right? Uh, yeah. Or, sorry. I mean, you had it right. Just, it needs a little further back. Oh. The angle. Yes. Got that parallelized arrow. Okay. Yep, exactly. All right. And I think I'm going to back up to give myself a little sure. bit more. Yeah, that's the... This it's, line it's is... to the line, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm off. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'm not going to do the red version, do the Vader version. Mm-hmm. Red, and then spend a force charge to focus way the heck over here. Mm-hmm. I think I'm still in range, unfortunately, but part of the way. Of wedge? Yes. Yeah. In case you want to do that, which you still could, range three. Yeah. It's a literal long shot. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Or you could do range one on the guy. I think the range one on the guy has a crack shot and in your bullseye. Yeah. And, I, the guy I need to go away. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. All right, so shooting times. Shooting time. Yep. Mm-hmm. Let's do the uh, the wedge shot here. And that's well open. So uh, only two range dice one. Because you're wedge. And I have uh, an extra attack because I'm Woo! range one. Mm-hmm. Here we go. All right, it's so, Come on, so, wedge. Uh, roll poorly. Ah! I like that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yep. okay, I need to get some paint, some white. Show me some white oh, dice. No. Oh, Got just one. enough. Oh, Lucky boy. Mm-hmm. Like I said, he was going to be here of the Rebellion, or here of the Empire. Yeah. Right, He's coming back. He's just like, you know. Just out of range of Luke there. Yep. Man. Let's do it. I could have used that. All right. <laughs> All right. Let's do the, the exciting range one. Range one shot. Range one bullseye. Oof. Crack shot. All that fun stuff. All the stuff. He's barely <laughs> holding on. Here we He's go. He's totally going to take one shot. <laughs> he might. Two oh, hits. Two hits. Ugh. The lingering crack shot. Ugh. Oh, he's not going to kill him. No, he's not going to kill him, but... Oh. Oh. Didn't even need the crack shot. Uh, oh, no. Por qué? Por qué? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. One and one. Damage. Yep. Yeah, he's going to focus. Yep. Um, uh, let's do this guy. Range two. Oh, no. Mm-hmm. Two dice. Yep. For wedge. Spends his focus. Oof. Uh, heating up. Things are heating up. <laughs> oh, no. You're holding up. It's getting your teeth. Ah! Get intense. Voice getting higher. Ah! Right. Last one here. Range three. Ah! Let's see if you can do it. I don't it. like those dice anymore. I don't like those dice anymore. <laughs> okay. Play the, play the dice for my, my poor rolling. Please. Unmodified. Here we go. <gasps> A crit! It gets one. It gets I one. got three dice. You should mathematically you should survive this. I mean, you seen it earlier. I did. It's, it's... I was here. <gasps> oh! oh my God. Oh. Ah. Well, yeah, you fought hard. Yeah, bye wedge. Bye wedge. What is that? That's uh, that was uh, five, no seven. Oh. Seven, seven dice. Seven dice. <sighs> all blanks. Oh. All blanks all the time. Rough. Just that's how I roll d eights. <laughs> <laughs> all blanks. All blanks. Uh, just for fun, what was the last crit you got there? Oh yeah, uh, which just, is just, just for fun. fun. You just, just got for the fun. One. Damage sensor. Right? Ah yes. The old Killed. classic. Yeah. I always felt like that was the worst damage in the previous. I mean, obviously, Blind of it's bad, but yeah. that one was really annoying. because I, I always got the double damage. That was the oh, one that, that just yeah. direct hit was just like, oh, and now you're just dead. Mm-hmm. I was like, oh, okay. Well, well, okay. Oh, brutal. Brutal. Yeah, Max likes to say the best debuff is death. It's true. Um, that, is a, that is a very good <laughs> So Woo. it's hard to attack back when you can't attack. It's true. All right. Back okay. To dials. <laughs> Back to die. Oh, sorry. 
Back to dying. It's not, not trying to be offensive. No, that. no, it's fine. It's, <laughs> okay, so uh, just for the camera, for yeah. the folks watching me get slaughtered here, I've got one goal at this point, and that is to fire my proton torpedoes <gasps> at number four. Oh, so that is all I want to do at this point. <laughs> Don't have a battle battle plan going in anymore. It is just a ven vendetta <laughs> to take out number four. I mean, he was he looked like a chump at the beginning. He did. He, I've got see, I've got him locked, uh -huh. and I've got one charge left, and I feel like Luke's mission in life is now do it, Luke. Just, just do it. So this is probably going to backfire because I just told him what I'm doing. Mm. But you know what? <laughs> something, something, trust the force. Oh, yeah. yeah. So here we go. I heard that before. All right. <laughs> it's going to be so bad. All right, you're up. Okay. Let's start... I'm not gonna use sense. Cause Are you sure? You don't wanna. Yeah, I'm not. I'm out of range. You're out of range. So, um, I don't mind if you spend the. Did you get your? Uh, oh, I didn't. Spray? Thank you. Thank you for remembering, reminding me. I'm All catching right. on. See, it only took me a whole game. <laughs> one turn. I can fly one ship. That's that's all I need. Yeah, I mean, you do only need one ship to win. Yeah. As a. Yeah, that's a bit of a. Oh no! Focus. Okay. Bit of a madnism. You need them. You only need to have one ship to win. <laughs> it's true. It's true. It's true. I feel like that's, that's the thing about the madnism. He's not wrong. Yeah, I feel like that's almost like a whoops. Oh my God. More like a Confucius thing. Yeah. Where it's just like, uh, okay. Yeah. I, I see what you're doing there. It's not wrong. Not wrong. All right, focus again. All targets turn to Luke. Bum, bum, bum. I probably just screwed this whole up, but I may have messed with you in the, at the same time. <gasps> so what? We'll what? See, we'll see what happens. What could you have done? Mind games. Yeah, probably. Ready? Ho! <laughs> Didn't see that coming. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> nope. But you are, you know, force user. Yep. Focusing yep. wasn't going to do much for you. Yep. And I think you might have dodged one. I can't use any actions because I didn't blow that, but. Uh -huh. I've yes. got you. I see. I was saying I was going after number four. Ah! I'm still trying to, but if oh. I take out number five on the way, then it works that's, out, right? That's also true. Yeah. I thought it was one of those jukes where you're like, I'm going for you, and then you punch the other guy. No. I'm trying to punch both. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to use the talent roll. So, I'm going to do If it. I survive the turn, <laughs> I'm coming for you. So, I got an interesting ability here. Yeah. So, after burners, after you fully execute a three. Uh, speed three to five maneuver, which I just did. Yeah, yeah. You may spend one charge to perform a boost action even while stressed. That's awesome. Right? It's the same art as auto thrusters from before. Yeah. Um, but is yes. auto thrusters gone? Or is that. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Take that. There's an ability thrusters. called auto thrusters. It's not even related. It's just okay. we liked that name. Yeah. Um, so we use the name again, not the effect. Okay. Because uh, turrets don't work the same way. Turrets don't work the same way. I, um, it wouldn't actually do anything. Yeah, I liked it. I liked the, the turret change. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I guess it would do something, but not the same. Obviously. Yeah, yeah. It just it's makes you mainless. plan. It makes you actually think about your turret versus just being this like, I'm going to shoot you with twin link, you know, mm -hmm. twin laser turret and just from wherever and just roll two dice the whole time and plink you to death. So <laughs> makes you think about it. So yeah, the uh, just to just be clear, I did. Fully execute, so I got the stress, and then I could afterburners to boost. Yeah, yeah, because so. it's afterburners. Yeah. Yep. So that's that. All right, Luke. We knew you. We we we, we knew you so well. Well, you're not dead yet. Well, eh, I've got two hull left. Yeah. We'll see. I got two. I only need one hull, right? I mean, yeah. You only need one hull. You only need one ship and one hull. Yeah. All right. Uh, blast away. So. Yeah. Do it. Range two. Let's do it. Well, again, that was not a juke. That was just me <laughs> playing poorly. But, I mean, I did get to dodge out of one arc, I think you so. did. I think this guy... We'll see. Yeah. So, here goes. Mm -hmm. Oh, I will use a force. Yeah, you'll get it recovered. Because I'll recover it when you shoot me to death. <laughs> the several times. Yep. yep. All right. Huh. Ah! But you did make me spend. Yep. Now, I, now you won't shoot me back with it. Not as well. Yep. <laughs> All right. All right. I guess we, we should have measured that. Still, right? Yeah, it was out of range. But. Yeah. Anyway. Um... Yep, uh, I'll just start with this one, range two. Yep, yep. If I had not spent my crack shot, hey. would have lined up that bullseye again. I don't know. Yeah! One hit. Uh, so I do get both dies. Yes, okay. you sure do. Oh, and I get your coverage. Yeah, yeah. Woo! 
Hey, you can spend it. I will totally spend that. Survivable Luke. Let's measure this guy here. Oh, yep. Yeah. Still an arc. Oh, just barely. All right, Just well, barely. Range two. two that's okay. That's okay. Did I charge again? Yes. Yeah. Of course. Ugh. Gotta use it. Gotta use it. Yeah. Oh! The fo I don't have to. Don't have to. Last one here. Let's see. I think this attack is obstructed. That's what I'm checking here. Oh! I don't see the asteroid there. Yeah. Barely, She's barely not a, not obstructed. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Range two. Spend the focus. Oh yeah. Two hits. Come on, loose. Luke. Luke. Just force. Force. Oh. Oh, yeah. you gotta do it. You gotta do it. Gotta do it. Uh, One damage. One damage goes through. Oh, you have, you have a shield from before. Oh, I do still have a shield. Ha! Huh. <sighs> I'll get you soon enough. It's true. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Back to dials. Back to dials. How long can I stall? That's the question. Yeah, right, we go. going to time. Go to time. What is, what is the time? Do we have a time limit? We've we not just, been timing. We're just playing for fun. So we're just playing. Yeah, it's true. Right. I'm done. You need the Top Gun card. It's just like, slam on the brakes, they'll go right past us. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that's a nurse damage, but whatever. Whatever. That's the point. I got, I got your point. Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah, no system phase stuff. Yep. I'm going to just do a two straight. In case you were going slow, which I don't know why you'd ever do that at this juncture. But who knows? You tricked me last time. <laughs> I tricked everyone last time with my cunningly cunning uh, misplay. That's all that was. All right. Then we'll do this guy. Who does... I'll do the other guy first, just for convenience. 4K! 4K! So, How could you? So, so aggressive with my... Throwing my templates around. Take that. Whew. Yeah, I'm coming for you, number four. <laughs> He's hiding behind you. I know. Somehow, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a stress maneuver with a cake. No. All right, one turn. Do a little doop. To your. Okay. I'm gonna remember to do this this time. I'm gonna lock oh. S foils in. Get out of here, position. All right, mm -hmm. we're gonna close the S foils. Yep. Reveal the maneuver. It's a two bank. Ooh. To the right. I'm gonna end up over there. Right. Um, yeah, we can do a little like. This is actually the best instance of this. Yeah. Do that. This guy, if you wanna hold on to Luke there for me. Uh, hold Luke. Or, yeah. Yeah, I'll hold Luke, and then you do that, and then I move that, and then we do that. Mm -hmm. Teamwork. Teamwork. That's right. When you're playing at home, don't be a jerk. <laughs> Teamwork. See. Boom. Look at that. Well, look at that. See? It was so efficient. Yeah. It's great. Right. Clears your stress. Clears my stress. Now the reason I did this <laughs> was because I was like, man, I bet boost is going to be real handy right now. Uh huh. Uh, this attack's already obstructed. Yeah. Um, it might. St I think it still will be even if you go straight because the it juts out just right. Amount. Yeah, like you might be able to strike. Uh, we'll see. If, if I boost, I think if I do like a boost one uh, with a, the the mm -hmm. bank. Mm -hmm. You might get, I might get out, out, out or even I'm, dodge entirely, true. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna go for that. I'd rather just not get shot than roll dice. <laughs> yes. Uh, much like death is the greatest debuff, yeah. uh, not getting shot is better than rolling, you know, Any 10 dice. Yeah. yeah. So I don't know if I'm gonna be out, out. I might be out, out, but yeah. Mm. But, but now I'm in that guy, so. That's it's, fine. But it's obstructed me. It's obstructed, so. yeah, in range three. So, again, rolling, not rolling dice is better than all right, did a three. Oh, man. Well, let's see if I can actually end up in your in, uh, range here. Mm. See, classic barrel roll. For yeah. sure I could. Yeah. I think I'm not. I think I'm still out. We'll see. Either way, I'm going to target lock I here. think we can shoot each other. We'll, we'll find out shortly. Yeah. I'm Which is bad for me. With my spend my force charge. With my two hole. Uh, let's see here. Do I care about focusing two? No. That is fine. I'm target locked. Oh. Could have boosted. No, I couldn't. I was here. I couldn't have boosted. Could have afterburners. Mm. Uh can you, you you can't use your uh force action to keep I could keep chaining them. But yeah. I can't do the same action twice. Can't so you, you still can't twice. do the action. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 
It'd have, you'd have to have another line that's like, you can pour them to me. Because mm-hmm. then, yeah, you could definitely. That would have... Uh-oh! <laughs> 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 right, <laughs> Surprise! I got... Rolling's a good trick. Yeah. Wow. Anyway. Yeah, Didn't so... see that roll. Have it in. Uh, yeah, I'm going to just hang on to my force charges. Okay. So, yeah, let's see if uh, we get to shoot each other I think here. we get to shoot each other. Uh, maybe, maybe. No. It's out. And I know you're at a slight angle here. Oh, so I get some dice? You do. Oh, snap. Super, super unlucky, because we were slightly askew. Yep. Tragedy. The door is ajar, and I am askew. So, Ooh. here it goes. I get four dice, huh? That's yeah. range one. Oh, this boy. Would be, this would be quite the shame. Oh. Something, something. Luke's my something father. <laughs> here we go. Ah! Ooh, force it. Yep. Yep. This is yep. bad. This is bad. <gasps> Ooh, you so gotta you do it. Only you block do it. the one. Still take two. That's it. Ugh. Did I just? You did. Did I just take Vader out? You did. No way. Yeah, I shouldn't have barrel rolled, or at least. Oh, I was ready to hyperspace out of here, <laughs> and I just killed Vader with it. With <sighs> Something, something, who's your daddy? I don't yeah. know. I'm not even going to pretend that was on purpose. So. Yeah, if I'd, if I'd had that in an arc there, I think I could have got... I think you would have shot first you. and taken me out for yeah, sure. Yeah, because I would have gotten four dice with a guarantee of this, <laughs> that, and the other thing. Like, it was gonna... roll, wait, roll four dice real quick. I just want to see what would have happened. Okay, so... Just because if you had shot me first... This and then yeah. just force point, and yeah. because of advanced arc, like, yeah. you're dead. You're just, just super dead. dead. I'm just super dead. But, unfortunately, you were slightly... Askew. My cunning plan of... Messing up and then getting lucky is working perfectly. All right. Let's see. Oh, let's this is this is gone, time. too. It is. <laughs> Yay! Oh, so and then Luke tragic. died to the guy. That Pathetic <laughs> range three obstructed attack. That would be great. Oh, it's going to happen. Oh, that's even the injured guy. Yeah, I know. Oh, I know. this remember, would be great. He killed, he killed Wedge. Oh, yes. He kills Luke. Mm-hmm. <gasps> okay. A crit. A crit. I mean, that could do it. That's all you need. I could get a direct hit. Uh, so it is obstructed. Right? Yeah, and it is range, range three. so I get four dice. You get four dice. Oh, and uh, I become the you defender. Do. So as long as you don't roll any white results. What were you saying about paint? <laughs> what were you saying earlier about me, uh, you know, uh, rolling seven agility dice, getting all blanks? Here we go. Uh-huh. <laughs> all the defense. <laughs> there they are. There they are. <laughs> Looks like, not now. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was so... So I mean, sad. I thought the game was over. Yeah, me too. I really did. I really did. Okay. Back to plan A, which was kill number four. <laughs> number four must die. Yeah. That's what happens when you're slightly askew. Mm-hmm. Oof. Just enough, too. Just, I know. Just enough. Because otherwise we'd have both not been able to attack. Yeah. I thought I thought after you said you were out, I was like, oh, well, then I'm definitely out. No. Apparently not. Yes. Because, the the pl- again, this is... This is a this is a known thing, but even the, the plastic base is part of the targeting area. Mm-hmm. So if you get any of that, yep, that that counts. Mm-hmm. Drop my dial again. Here we go. Go first. Yep. Two turn. I know it's right over that asteroid, but. You're just going for the throw. I mean, That's you're doing fine. what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. See if it takes damage. It's worth it. He does. He's good. See? He's good. What, what were you worried good. about? <laughs> Did I sound worried? <laughs> yeah. I'm fine. We're fine here. It's I'm fine. Good. How we're are good you? Here now. Yeah, exactly. Rector Lee, very bad. Uh... <laughs> Focus. You got this, number four. One turn. All eyes on Luke again. Shocked. Shocked to say. Focus. Where's the, where's the, is this the part where Han Solo comes in and saves you? <laughs> You're all clear, kid. No, all right. What is this thing? Go home. Where did you just? I just picked up my dial. There it is. That was a 4K turn. <gasps> 4K. 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 I figured I'm gonna go out. Let's let's do it. <laughs> let's do it. Let's do it. Number four with I mean, the target that's... lock. Yeah. At range two to three. Yeah. Is it my? I think it's my go. It is. Por- torpedo time. It, it is torpedo time. Yeah. I told you guys this was my my secret plan all along. Mm, yep. yep. I bumped that guy a little bit. That's, that's okay. Four dice. 
Here goes. Yes. Here goes. Oh, go. spend the charge. Mm-hmm. Torpedoes away. Woo. Yeah, okay. I can't. Uh, I can't make this one. Change one hit to a crit just for fun mm-hmm. because that's what it does. You might as well spend the lock. Yeah. Oh, because I. You're like you're probably gonna kill him anyway. Yeah. Well. Oh, and then I'm gonna mm-hmm. force it. Cause... Sure. Force it. Yeah. Yep. And dead. Very dead. <laughs> Mission accomplished, go home. Some, some damage cards. <laughs> Run away! <laughs> all right, this is all the things. All right, can, can you do two damage? Hopefully. I mean, uh, range two. There it goes. Here's two, ready? I and a, two damage. Target. Mm-hmm. Here it goes. Oh! Oof. Do you have that eye still? No, oh, I didn't. I can't. Sorry. And mountain bullseye anyway. So I'm gonna have to use that. Yeah. Get it back. That's fine. Range three. Get it back. I'll spend it. Two hits. Yep. Here it goes. Here it goes. Two on two. Oh! <gasps> spend it. Spend just it. Down to one. Down to one. And it is one. And there we go. My heart. Oh! <laughs> I don't know if I can take it, man. All right. <laughs> My two guys are uninjured, but that doesn't mean too much because they are TIE fighters. That's true. Uninjured TIEs, uh, are they still, what is it, still two? What, three hull? Three hull, yeah. Three hull, yeah. No shields, obviously, because yep. they're TIEs. You guys should quit the Empire and join the Rebels because they don't care about you. That's why you don't have shields. Just saying. <laughs> uh, That's a tight man. Now the question, are you going to try to bump me mm-hmm. just to... Just because, I mean, you, you should. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So then you know, I'm going to do that. So therefore, you're going to do that to not to do that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. That's how it goes. Oh, crap. We what? screwed up, man. What? My s foils are closed. I should be rolling one less no, die. torpedo. I torpedoed you. Oh, that's true. Mm-hmm. You were fine. Okay. I'm in on Vader, though. On Vader? Uh, I think you were fine. Oh, Maybe. Yeah. Got to remember the new stuff. Gotta this is all stuff. new to me. It's okay. Mm-hmm. I looked down. I was like, my s wheels are closed. Oh, man. My bad. My bad, internet. <laughs>force charge yes force charge. focus I don't think. we'll see what happens oh that was a terrible idea for me okay I, I had a feeling I had a feeling all right question is if I actually bumped you you'll still get to shoot me but if I barrel you won't get to shoot if I bumped mm-hmm. and you're stressed so you didn't do any schmancy koi grand whatevers I couldn't I wanted to. All right, let's see if I can get lucky. Yep. Oh, there's, yeah. Here we go, folks. Two straight, one straight. Yep. Clears that stress. I'll just, it does clear the stress though, right? It does. Is... Do the classic slide along the edge maneuver. Boop. Boop. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. No stress. All right, here we go, range. No. No action though. Nope, no action. And yep, no range shots. one. Three dice. Here it is. Just gonna do one. Piddly damage. One piddly damage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right. Let's try this again. All right. Okay. Unfortunately. I think you know what I'm going to do. Because yes. I have to. Well, you don't have to. Uh, it's true. That's true. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to pretend I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm showing my hand here, but I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That makes me, makes me turn. Yeah, let's do that. I'll be fine. Right. I'm going to drop that again. There you go. Put it back. Okay. <laughs> yes, that's right. Let's try that. All right. Let's start with this guy. Does yeah. it one turn. Like this. So, if you 4K'd, instead 4K. of doing the maneuver you were hinting at, yeah, that'd be great. Yeah. If I barrel roll, we're good either way. Yeah. So I think I'm gonna barrel roll. You don't wanna just focus and mm, blast away? Not really. That's fair. Just because 
that actually is pretty much any maneuver you do is still analog. Yeah, yeah. I think that's a good call. All right. Then I'm going to do a 3K! 3K! All right. So, 3K, 3K. Yes. I'm going to do the elaborate version. Ooh. So this is, of course. Mathematically. Yeah. Mathematically. Mm -hmm. All right. For the folks at home that don't know, a five is a three with a two. And yeah, the, the one bases are one. On either end. So, so if you just do that and boop, then boop, boop. line up the back ends, you're good. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. Yeah. We didn't have to move any ships. It was great. Yeah. Yeah. It takes the stress. Worth it. You can. Uh, Here we go. Ah, yes. Oh, did I bump you? Oh, we went to the right. Oh, uh, yeah. I totally went that way. That makes more sense. So. Yeah, if you went the other way, I would have just denied and you'd be stressed facing the wrong. Oh, that'd be terrible. Yeah. So at least I got that part right. Now I face it that way, right? Oh, yeah. Do you want to open your. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know, I am, am going to do that. Sorry. Boop, boop. They're open. I'm going to change the card. So I'm facing that way, right? Uh, nope. That nope. Way. That way. I get it mixed up. That's what I was worried mm. about. Okay. I'm not used to town rolling with, with T65s. That's yeah. what it is. It's just throwing <laughs> me off. So that's that's slide up, right? I can do that? Uh, yeah. Boop. Okay. Yes. Cool. Takes the stress. Yep. Worth it. Flip my thing over to remind myself. Range. Two, three. Range three. Range three. Mm -hmm. All right. First shot. Three dice. Yes. Here it goes. Ooh. One. 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 Ah, More ah, than one. Ah, uh oh. All right. Come back. Come back. Yeah. One. Okay. <laughs> is that uh, from which guy? Oh, uh, this guy. Range three? Yeah. Okay, three dice, right? Yep. Huh. Ooh. Oh, I gotta do it. You do, otherwise you'd be dead. Range two. Other guy. One more. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> One. Here we go. Oh. Party Luke. All right. Hey guys, so Luke had to go to hyperspace because the place we were playing at was booked and we were playing really long. So we're going to call that one a draw. Yeah, <laughs> that okay? that's fine. That's okay. <laughs> sorry about not showing you guys the end of the game, uh, but it was really good. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry. Uh, I made a lot of rookie moves, um, but that was probably part of my strategy. Yeah. Of, of rolling. Deeper strategy, yes. Yeah, I'm bad. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'll work on it. I probably, especially with this new edition. Oh yeah. Uh, Frank, by the way, thanks for showing me the ropes. Yeah. Uh, it's <laughs> been a pleasure. The game is a ton of fun. I mean, it was already a really solid game, and I feel like the second edition is just going to explode again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, I guys, feel really comfortable about it. Yeah, you guys put in a ton of cool work, a, a ton of cool changes. Uh, there was there wasn't really a change I can think of that that we played around with that I was like, I don't know if I liked it. Everything was like. Yes, everything just feels better. There's a ton of quality of life improvements. Um, it, again, it took me a couple seconds. It, like, the talent roll with the uh, with mm -hmm. the T65. What? <laughs> <laughs> so turning. Yeah. How does it turn out? Does it flip? I don't know. But it's so good. Like, oh, I um um just to echo what, kind of what Max was saying mm -hmm. before too. Like, um one of the other designers, Max. Uh, the um the the T65 probably most improved ship in yes. the game. Yes. Yeah. I think I said that, but that's... Yeah, well, he agreed. both you guys. Yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes. He said it was his favorite ship. Yes. And then, you and said then I most said most improved. improved. Yeah. Yes, that's so, what happened, yes. <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, anything you want to say to the folks at home about it? Like, um, I, Yeah, look forward to it coming out soon. Yeah. Um, it's going to be great. Yeah, it's so good. Go check it out. Uh, thanks again to FFG for, for hosting and having me over uh, and, and showing us uh, Star Wars X-Wing 2.0. Woo! I'm Adam here from Bulls. Thanks for watching. Click to subscribe, support us on Patreon, check out more videos, and thanks for watching.